Maren Morris says her young son received death threats after she criticized Morgan Wallen for racial slur. It's incredibly dangerous and scary, and you just open up a whole can of worms of crazy people. Maren Morris called out Morgan Wallen for using a racial slur in 2021, and she says the consequences of that decision seriously affected her family. My Church singer recently detailed the fallout of her criticism of Wallen's use of the N-word that year. The death threat portion for me as a young mother was obviously scary, and it wasn't death threats against me. It was against my son, too, Morris, who gave birth to her first child in 2020, said in a new interview with Sophia Bush on her Work in Progress podcast. So it's like, oh wow, now we're involving the kids, the ones that you cared so much about. It's incredibly dangerous and scary, and you just open up a whole can of worms of crazy people and pundits that kickbox the hell out of you. Morris says she faced backlash after calling out Wallen for using the N-word in a video in 2021, tweeting that female musicians would be dropped, endorsements lost, social pariahs to music row in a similar situation. She also tweeted that Wallen's use of the slur and the lack of lasting consequences for it actually is representative of our town because this isn't his first scuffle and he just demolished a huge streaming record last month regardless. We all know it wasn't his first time using that word. We keep them rich and protected at all costs with no recourse. Despite the terror she felt after the death threats, Morris told Bush that she'd still speak out if she could go back in time. I stand by what I said. I don't regret it. I don't apologize, she said. I feel the exact same way as I did that day. Would I maybe use the channels of Twitter again? Probably not. There's probably more dignified ways to get my point across. But hey, it is what it is. Don't be racist. Don't be transphobic. Don't be homophobic. All the things, I still stand by that. So if you're expecting me to feel bad, no. Morris did admit that she was somewhat baffled by the negativity she encountered after her remarks. When you're so in the middle of this eye of the hurricane, you're like, how are people this pissed over the criticism of cruelty, she said. And I think it's because they're not only defending the person that said this, but they are taking it personally as if I'm criticizing them, which I think says a lot more about their interpretation of criticism and what that content was than me as a person calling out someone using the N-word, or even transphobia that I've criticized in the past. That sort of exploded in another wave. Listen to the full conversation between Morris and Bush above.